Hey guys, how's it going? Now, WhatsApp is a chat IM that we all use and it's overloaded with features. So not as much as Telegram, but still has a lot of features up its sleeve. Now they introduced a new feature, which is the ability to react to messages. You know how you could do on Instagram messages. Similarly, you can now react to WhatsApp messages. But do you guys know everything about it? If not, watch this video till the very end. This is one from Guiding Dick. And in today's video, we'll be taking a deeper look at everything that's new with the reactions to messages on WhatsApp. Let's get started. All right, first things first, let's actually look at the kind of reactions that are available on WhatsApp. So currently WhatsApp offers six emojis that you can use to react to messages, which are thumbs up, heart, a face with tears of joy, a face with the mouth open, a crying face, and finally a person with folded hands. Unfortunately, these are the only six reactions that you can choose from. Unlike Instagram that actually gives you the whole array of emojis, WhatsApp restricts you to just these six emojis. Now, new emojis might be added on later, but for now, these are the only six emojis that exist. All right, so let's start off by talking about how you can use WhatsApp reactions on your mobile device, whether it's Android or iOS. Open a WhatsApp conversation and long press on the message that you wish to react to. Here, you will now see the emoji reactions bar pop up on your screen. Just select the emoji that you wish to react with and it will show up at the bottom edge of the message bubble. Now, if you wish to see how many people have reacted to that message, just tap on the emojis icon showing up on the message bubble. You will now see a new window showing all the various reactions on a single message. Now, the good part about reactions is that they're not just restricted to your mobile apps. You can actually react to messages on WhatsApp using your WhatsApp web or the desktop client as well. All you have to do is to just open a conversation in WhatsApp on the web app. Then hover over a message to see the new emoji icon appear over it. Just tap on the emoji icon to react to a message with any of the six available options. Now there is a possibility that you might have mistakenly reacted to a message in a wrong manner. I mean, you were supposed to send an emoji of a crying face, but for some reason you laughed at it. Like seriously, it happens to the best of us. But anyway, the good part is that WhatsApp does allow you to easily change your reaction as well. On your Android and iOS devices, you can just long press on the same message again to see the emoji reaction bar. Your existing reaction will be highlighted in gray. Now, just simply select another emoji to change your reaction and you're done. On the WhatsApp web and desktop apps, hover over the same message to see the emoji icon once again. Once again, click on the emoji and select your new reaction. And that's it. And that's not all. If you wish to remove a reaction, WhatsApp does give you that feature as well. On an Android or iOS device, just tap on your emoji reaction that shows at the bottom of the chat bubble. You will now see a pop-up with your reaction and you can just tap to remove the same reaction with ease. Alternatively, if you're using WhatsApp on your WhatsApp web or on the Windows or Mac OS desktop app, after clicking on the emoji reaction on the chat bubble, you just have to select the click to remove option to redact your reaction. And well, that was it. If you found this video helpful, make sure to let us know by giving us a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel for more awesome tech content. Till then, this is one from Guiding Tech and I'll see you in the next one.